what is up ladies and gentlemen and welcome to the VR game mods as you can see we start out here in the new library the library hall I guess because I don't see no library books or is this a church I, I really can't tell um okay uh so let's just get into it and open up the book the first page. There's whispers around here. Oh, cute little butterfly. I think that's a monarch butterfly. Can't grab it though. I need to reposition myself in my chair. Can't blow out the candles. Please excuse the squeaky chair. I can't fix that. Oh. Ooh. Nice. Your time has come at last, dear reader. While we heck? began this tale long ago, we hope it is yours to finish. But this story is not yours alone. No, it is tied to another. And the journey you take together could change the fate of both our worlds. Shall we begin? I guess. Oop. Next they phase. called it the Cinder Knight. Ooh. What Here's came the, uh, from those dark, oh, no, starless that's not a, skies would change the world of moss forever. The peace that had settled across the land was broken by an unconquerable nightmare. And that night, the animals nearly met their end. Oh, not those cute little mouses. First, they killed the king. Oh, wow. The winged creature broke Green. from the shadows and plucked him from his royal bedchamber high atop the tallest tower. That looks like a sea worm. Next, the serpent from one of the Sarkov Michael Bay and the armies movies. of the Arcane That's what it tore up me from of. the underworld. They ravaged the castle in search of that which gave the king power beyond understanding. One of the fabled glass relics. Glass relics? Oh man, this face is heavy. The King's Guard fought bravely, but the castle mm. soon pulsed with the Arcane's evil. Oh, every room was gutted, every statue, tapestry, and adornment hexed. But the oh. glass was never found. Oh, that's not good. Even the reclusive oh. sprites set aside their differences on that faded night. They sent a great champion, empowered by their that. own glass relic, to challenge the serpent and its steel army. Huh. Thought I heard something. I like that. The back of that guy, Dalma. Meanwhile, oh. Sir Argus, commander of the Here's King's Guard, just led the survivors west to the temple long the abandoned by their ancestors. Person. So we only have the use of one. Risen enemies. It was an arduous escape. Oh. Finally, after passage beneath the impassable mire, they found refuge in a clearing hidden safely in the trees. Okay, so the uh, Argus start charged life. back to join the sprite champion at the mire's edge. Together, they fought back the arcane and sealed the temple the passage that led to the arcane made by Robotnik? But those all look like robots the champion to me. Was gravely injured. Those all look like robots. Clutching his glass, he retreated deep into the forest where he drew his last breath. Whoa. A large tree grew uh, I guess you could say he's trying it to branch out. years in watching <laughs> safeguarding the glass and awaiting its next hero. Oh. Oh, I know what's coming up next. So everyone, shoot the eyes because this is going to get bright. Ah, right now I'm closing my eyes inside the hit VR helmet because I don't want to get blinded by the light. As soon as I see, feel like the light is starting to dissipate, I'm going to open my eyes then. But until that happens, I'm not going to do it. The light is still there, I can tell. I can hear the forest things, but I can see that the light's still there. I think this is like their version of loading screens. 
But man, it's taking. Okay, now I can open my eye. That hero. Oh. Albeit an unlikely one. <laughs> did arrive but, but, at a time oh. she'd be needed most. Ooh. Hero. Uh, let's reposition it. There we go. <laughs> I can make the water dance. Hmm? Hey, dear. Quill was out adventuring Hero. beyond the edge of the clearing. Dusk was creeping in, but she wondered what she might find if she went just a little farther. Oh, I'm actually using my my uh, webcam microphone. Of all the microphones I have, the uh, webcam microphone seems to be the best quality I have. So, on the plus side, when I wear my headset, it actually it's made of plastic, so if I move my head in a certain way, or start speaking in a certain way, moving my mouth, it makes a clicking sound, which is basically the sound of the plastic being stressed and stuff, and then it get recorded into the literally recording, and that's annoying. So. Up the three options of microphones I have. This is my best. She was choice. not exactly sure what she roused, Hi. but she felt no danger from the being silently peering down at her. And she, she as she shouldn't. She's a doll, bro. I wouldn't mind having that little mouth as a pet. Quill had to hurry. But my the village cat gates would soon close, have other and night would follow. For it. Oh. I think now I can control her. Okay, yeah. Invisible wall. Wait. Is that a wooden sword she's carrying? If we had speaking that so much shit, I can't do anything about that. Oh, wait a minute. I already mentioned that, dude. Hmm? What? She was like, uh-uh, don't do that. She's cute. Hup, hup, hup. Yep, invisible wall. And hop, hop, and away we go. This is like a diorama. Oh, there she is. Oh, do I need to reposition myself again? Oh, no I didn't. Let's just do this. Moving close like this. So that way. Yeah, that works out good for me. Hup. And hup. And grab that. Oh, out. Put my psychic powers. Huh, she just gave me a thumbs up. Haha. -ha. Can't cut these yellow flowers. Ooh. Actually, we can get a good look at it from this angle. Oh, we can see some cobwebs there. Nice. Really nice. Okay, next. Please definitely heard the page turning and now it's another load screen. To load in the next area. Which we were all right over there. And now we're over here. Okay. Uh. Okay, Night. Sure her uncle often warned was when danger was most present. But Quill preferred the stories of the magical creatures that woke to protect the forest. That sounded like a... Oh, wow. <laughs> and... Okay. And pull this back over with my psychic abilities. And now Quill can jump up there. Can I like avoid it? No, I can't avoid that scroll, which is a piece of glass. We'll see that when we're back in the library function. Again, with the blackness up here. It's obviously gotta be a reference to the low screens. Which I whoa. Okay, where is she? Oh, 
empty is the gates. And it is closed on her. You're late, Creel. You're freaking late. Let's see. Oh yeah, there's some crates there. Let's smash them. Don't know what those little sparks are for. If I pause the game, you can see right there that we got three powder. That must have been from the uh, crates we smashed. And one piece of glass. So, yeah. Well, we got some more crates over here with bells and so. That should really be that. Be six or five. Five so they won't carry anything the open barrel. Go ahead out of there. I honestly don't know where I just flicked. Oh, I still gotta move. Another load. Why, that one was fast. Oh. Okay. I'm not gonna pause the game every time I collect these little things. But uh, we are collecting some. Oh! I see a scroll up there. So, Creel's gotta get up there somehow. And I think I just... Oh, it wants me to open the gate, but... Oh, there we go. Come on. Ah. Here we go. You know, this is just so amazing. You know, couldn't I to just jump over it? Does she really have to open up the gate? Or in this case, me? Couldn't she just like, like I said, jump over it? I don't get it. Okay. Um, oh, we're in the village. Tree stump, tree stump. Little houses. You know, for a bunch of mice, they, wait, they can even make lanterns? And that obviously looks like it's made of metal, so these little mice obviously know how to work a forge and make glass panes, obviously, considering they have windows, and those windows look like they have glass in them. And she... And she's dead. She can't... Okay. Alright, so I'm guessing one of those mice is already adopted considering one is black. Black mouse. Okay, I can't get any further than that. Oh, they got some... So I'm guessing that log must be hollow. If they have like those little houses on the side. What is this? Fall? Yeah, there's leaves falling from the trees, so is this considered fall rather? Okay, well, I'm not getting anything, so I'm pretty sure we get at least three scrolls or something. Again, with the black screen, there's another scroll that we have to get. And if I'm in search, we have to slow this down, hold it on to it, and see if we can really climb it. And I messed it up. Oh. Okay, reach for it. And jump. Okay, reach for it. There we go, got it that time. And I'm just gonna keep holding that until I get over there. Hopefully I don't mess this up and have to do this all over again. Okay. I was a little concerned about grabbing that scroll and if it would like stop me from holding that thing down. Okay, gotta be careful because I'm pretty sure I mess this up, I have to do this all over again. Okay, so... 
Okay, wait for it. Wait for it. And hop, hop. And now we just. This one is having a little difficult. Thanks to her new friend, Phil had saved priceless grains from the hourglass. How? How does precious grain from the hourglass? How is that possible? We just lowered the bridge. Oh, maybe they're talking about the scroll. No, that can't be right. If it was about the scroll, it would have said that as soon as I picked it up. So that really doesn't make any sense about right there. So let's just move on. Oh, and... She raced to the door of the cottage she shared with her uncle. Oh, look at this girl. Once he saw her discovery, he'd lose himself in tales of its legend. Yeah. Look at the way she's hopping. Hoppity hippity hoppity hoppity hippity hoppity hoppity hop. Hop 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 Into the door I go. Ah, damn it! I forgot about that part. Ah. Ah, dang it. Hmm. Oh, back in the library, and look. Uncle Argus was watching okay, the we are just doing it. Dim when Quill burst we got the front door three their cottage. pieces of Uncle, glass Uncle, here. Show us there, so see? I guess we make like a picture or something. Out past the bell again, he scolded. Ooh. Quill, I've told you countless times. So, I know, Quill replied, huh. crestfallen. I didn't mean to worry you, but I found something strange and magical. Uh huh. Okay, so how does this work? So is this narrator telling us the story that has happened, and then we go into the world, we take control of Quill and the reader, which is what we are basically about to be, and it then shows us the true experience what Quill's she has hands gone through. trembled as she showed him the glass. What is it? Ooh. She asked. A look of panic spilled over her uncle's stoic exterior. Oh. Where did you find this? Roared Uncle Argus. Look, his eyes Will glowing. Will never seen <laughs> her uncle so shaken. His brain. Brain. <laughs> Just west of the clearing, she explained. And as soon as I picked it up, something started helping me. Hi. Uncle Argus followed her motion. Hello. A reader. With you, here, yeah. right now? I guess I'm a reader. Quill, what you found is very powerful and very dangerous. Seriously? He said great concern. I'm not dangerous. If I could oh, take talking this about burden the, from you, I would. But this reader has chosen. I can always read chose. Oop. Okay, Even what's next? with the moon full and bright, I must go right away. Quill pressed. Where are you going? I can help. We can help. No, he snapped. They'll find you and tear you apart. Who I have to they? It is he's that, he's being safety. very vague. And for everyone here in the clearing. His long, heartfelt hug oh, told her he was heading That's for adorable. Danger. I think I found the thumbnail for this video. That was adorable. I'll be back before midnight. Until I return, I need your word you will not leave the clearing with that glass. Promise me, Quill. I oh. promise, she said reluctantly, wondering where her uncle was going so deep into the night. Hmm. Oh. Nope. Okay, I think for this first part, I'll end it here. So if you like this, make sure to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video with your friends. And until the next one, this is Edge, signing off. Hey guys, if you enjoyed this gameplay and want to see more of it, why not hit that subscribe button? Don't forget to drop that like and share it with your friends. 
and don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you'll be notified when new videos are available. Until the next video, this is Ez signing off.